Good day. How are you? Good day to okay. you. How are you doing? Good. It's been early, early day today. Oh, well, where are you guys calling me for? I want to let my audience know first I'm talking to Debbie Mazar and her husband, Gabrielle Corcos, and they are the cooking husband and wife team that we get to see on TV. Where are you guys calling me from today? Today we're, we're in Manhattan. Ooh. New York City. New York, New York. Just like I pictured. Just Okay. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Well, thank you for joining us. I, I, you guys have been doing so, so much. If I start with you, Debbie, uh, hopefully that's okay with Gabriella. Women are always first in my world. Yes. Ladies first, always. I mean, always. I'm Amen. a good Italian boy. That's what Mama taught me. Ladies first. All right. I Plus, like she, that. she talks too much regardless, so she would cut Do me you, off. Who's talking now? <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Debbie, what have you guys been up to? I see, I see you guys are in town in Italy. You guys got a big new kitchen. Well, actually, this is not our kitchen. We're on a stage. Well, wherever you are, you gotta <laughs> remember you guys started off in this the tiny nice little kitchen, kitchen in Manhattan. Yeah, no, you know, today uh, we're, we're, we're celebrating in general Italian Heritage Month. My husband is from Tuscany, um, and. Uh, we are partnering with Bertoli. Bertoli is a company that uh, originated in Tuscany as well. Um, it's their 150th anniversary. And Bertoli has partnered with No Kid Hungry uh, to feed children. There are one, like one out of five children across our country are not eating. They're Isn't that hungry. crazy? And um, it is crazy. so, we, you know, we're here to raise money. We're here to share Italian heritage. Um, you know, Bertoli for this anniversary has made a line of sauces called uh, the Italian the, the Italian Riserva. And um, there, like, there, there's four different flavors. Right now, we are making the marinara, and my husband is turning it into what's called amatriciana. Which, what does that translate to? It comes from amatricia. It's like pancetta, garlic, hot pepper flakes. Has a nice kick to it. A touch of proteins. Uh, Saltiness, pepperiness, like that tingling that you can feel in the back. Pancetta isn't bacon, by you know, the way. Well, pancetta is a pork belly it's, that is cured, but it's not smoked. That's just the difference. It's yeah. smoked while bacon is smoked. So, so you yeah, you that, just to you know. be, I, I don't know if you can see this, but like it's like sure lovely. Well, don't, don't burn don't, your don't husband, I'm not going to burn you. Um, so we're, 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 we're doctoring says. this up uh, just because we want it to taste a little bit more spicy. Well, but this is the thing, you know, people always ask us, uh, you're always cooking, you're always cooking. Here, well, why it's, don't we it's cook? True. Here, why you, don't we you, cook? You, you talk. You know, to, to a degree, th this is what we do. But I even remember my mother when I was a kid, like working parents not always have the luxury to be able to stay at the stove uh, for like an hour, an hour and a half every night to prepare dinner. Now, you're tired uh, you know, or whatever. It, it, it is my job. Uh, I, I have my restaurant. I'm always cooking. So it, it doesn't really make a difference for me. But when it comes to keeping something in the pantry to make your life a little easier and to really enable you to sit down for dinner with your family and loved ones, uh, why not have a fantastic sauce like the one that Bertoli makes? Now, today we're using the marinara for this specific recipe, but within the reserva line, there are other three fantastic flavoring. We do have the asiago, an artichoke that I actually like to use in vegetarian uh, dishes like, you know, my vegetarian lasagna or obviously other dishes of pasta. There is the balsamic with the caramelized onions, and that is absolutely sick. If you grill some eggplants, uh, some garlic, some uh, mint, uh, sage, uh, olive oil, salt and pepper put together, add a little bit of this sauce, and it can become bruschetta, can become a pasta sauce. And then and obviously, you know, last but not least, porcini and truffle oil that can become mm -hmm. a fantastic bruschetta or, again, a dish for pasta. Or, in this case, I added some olives and I made a wonderful chicken cacciatura, which is a very traditional Toscan dish. So... Sitting at the table and having dinner together, having a meal together, shouldn't be taken for granted. And that's and what that's we're what, here. Yeah, we want everybody to uh, yes. take, take a picture. It could be of, of anything that's sort of Tuscan inspired. Use a hashtag, my Tuscan table, and post it. And, and Bertoli will give a dollar uh, for every, you know, post that you do. And it all goes, oh, to, so and it all goes to the kids. Yes, and one dollar actually produces 10 meals. So think about that. And one of the things I actually encourage, you know, we're here, we're adults, we're doing it. Tell your kids to do that. They're always a stick with their phone. You're paying the phone bill. Tell them, you know it's what, It's good for today, them to be aware. Please do that. Be aware. You know, you're yeah. lucky tonight. You're having dinner. It takes 10 seconds. 10 seconds is 10 meals. You know, my kid, my kid, that. my kid, oh, well, I was going to say my kid goes to public school and she is aware of like how lucky she is because many kids don't come to school with good things in their lunchbox. So go to villabertoli.com, go to their Facebook profile, check every, every channel, share the My Toscan table. 
and uh, celebrate life, celebrate their 150th anniversary, celebrate with their loved ones, and uh, feed the kids. Help well, us out. Bon well, we love our totally, so we can do that for you guys, and you guys are a great duo. I'm telling Thank you, you guys much. are a handful. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. you. We'll see you soon, Texas. We'll come back. Yeah. We loved it there. Please come back. Thank we you. Will. Yeah. Promise. Y'all.